Hello, YouTubers. This is Johnny. Welcome back to Old NASA channel. Today, I'm going to talk about the security education. Um, usually, we call it security awareness training. So, we are using Proofpoint platform. Um, they bought out from Wamba. It used to be called uh, Wamba Security Awareness Training Platform. Now, it's Proofpoint product. Once you logged in, you will see the four major um, categories. So, all the features basically they can do assess, they can do educate, they can do reinforce, they can do math. Based on each feature, they have different uh, uh, different page for that, different product set for that. For example, for assess, you can do cyber strength assessment, the phishing campaign. For educate, you can do training, new assignment, you can do set up your training jacket, you can also customize your training mode. Reinforce, you can configure feature alarm, you can security awareness materials, you can get more security awareness materials from our, our community, security awareness community. Also, measure you can use the reports, you can see the assignment user details, also the risk, fail the summary. So, let's go through the left side menu. So, on the side strength, you can create assignment and it, based on the assessment you need to do. So, for the assessment template, you can see. A predefined template here. There's all kinds of uh, predefined assessment. You can just copy them, let them approve, and then use it in your assignment, cyber strength assignment. Also, you can see the questions. You can change the selection of the questions. Just you can choose whatever you need it for the categories, and then use it to build your own assessment assignment as well. Report, obviously you can get a report for, the, for your assignment, cyber strength assignment. Threat steam, threat simulation, usually we call it using phishing campaign. What that means, you can set up a phishing campaign to send out phishing emails to all your users and see how they handle it. So I have another video to show you the process, how to do that. That's a threat simulation um, training. That's the most important part for this platform. You're gonna create an assignment, just like I did here before, all kinds of assignment. Um, there's a module you can choose from, uh, which module you want to release to your user to work on and just choose it when you create an uh, assignment. Um, you can get the creating assignment web page, enter a name, enter a same type, starting date and due date, and you need to set up a notification. You may want to create, create a couple of uh, reminders to your users, and then you need to choose a module. That's what we talk about. Eventually, you need to choose the users as well. Um, that's it, modules. We have modules, we have some settings here. Um, yeah, you can create your own training jacket. So what kind of front jacket, the back training jacket, and certificate training jacket. And after that, there's a report. Fish alarm. Fish alarm is, um, is some Piece of a plugin you can install on your Outlook on your Gmail, and that's how it looks like. And then, when you receive a fish email, then you can just click that button and report it. It will be useful when you creating a threat simulation. It will be very useful when you buy it with a threat simulation campaign. So you can because um, the phishing owner will know this is uh, not a real phishing email, it's coming from your phishing campaign. 
that will give you specific report to distinguish from those real phishing emails, right? Here's the report, same thing. After that, uh, you can see all products reports and uh, you can manage your users. Can set up a notification, that's very important part. So you want to set up your training campaign, new training assignment. Whenever you have a new assignment, this email can send out. So that's default enabled. For the uh, ah, for the notification, a different purpose. They look similar, but they for different purpose. For the cyber strength auto enrollment. So when you do cyber strength assessment here, if you found out that somebody doesn't have very strong strong knowledge on certain topic, you can auto enroll them into a new assignment. That's the notification come out. Same thing on a phishing campaign, threat simulation, phishing campaign. If the user failed a phishing campaign, like, then you can set up an auto enrollment here to let them to auto enroll into some training. Okay, this is for the training. Once you finish your training, the user will get the email. That's how it looks like. You set up a notification here. Let's remind the training email. That's uh, cyber strength, new assignment. Those are very important. You need to adjust it each time when you send out your new assignment for cyber strength, for training, or adjust it accordingly. Don't assume it is crap. You will make mistake from there. That's pretty much everything. So one thing I want to show you is that the email. Once you send out an email, I will get you will get this kind of thing. That's like okay, one by training platform send you email based on your notification settings. So you will get a link. And you will get the link here. So let me log out. Sign out. I already sign out this. And then I'm gonna start my training here. So you get this link. Just click it, you automatically log it in. You don't have to log in again. They know who you are and they know the module you need to be working on. So here is the password management. I'm going to start this training right now. And then best practice for managing password and the pins, start. Introduction, start. Of course, it's wrong. Protect password and pin. Don't write them down. Don't share. Next. Get a story. And next is manage.
password manager. And now I finished all training, but there's other training you can use. So it will not limit it only this training. You can still work on other modules based on the platform settings. Very good uh, way to do the security aware training in the company. As John suggested, to try. This is a proof point solution. Uh, there's some other company in the market with similar solution. Um, but uh, it's a good way to do it. Thank you all for watching. Mm -hmm.